Okay, so I was shuffling and I did a quick reading. And when I was done, I was getting everything together. And then once I started um, shuffling again, um, got some cards that just popped out. We got a King of Pentacles and the Eight of Swords that came out paired up. Somebody is feeling trapped. There's a King of Pentacles energy, all right, that is feeling trapped, feeling like they're in the Eight of Swords, but they have no idea how to move. They feel trapped, they feel bounded, they feel stuck. But this is the King of Pentacles. There's no way that this person can be stuck if they're in the upright. This has to be in their head. This King of Pentacles could be in their head about something. Okay. King of Swords. King of Pentacles is stuck, feeling down, feeling trapped, feeling stuck there in their head over a King of Swords. Alright. What's going on with this King of Swords? King of Swords is in a Knight of Cups energy. King of Swords is in a, a Knight of Cups energy. Uh, okay. So this person, not only are they like, um, you know, very, you know, stern, individual, guarded, you know, they very, very sharp when they have to be, okay? Um, This person is not only like that, but they also, they they stay in a um, non-consistent type of energy. Alright, this is the type of person, they know exactly what they see within people. They know exactly um, how they feel about certain situations and they discern people uh, very well this person stays in a knight of cups energy this is a very non-consistent individual Okay. Yeah, that's probably why this person is stuck because this is either a relationship or a partnership that this King of Pentacles is feeling stuck that they're in. Okay, because, you know, they. This one is constantly giving out this, you know, in and out type of energy towards them. All right, let's see what this is. What is this? Is this some sort of partnership, relationship? What are the emotions that are attached to this? What's going on? And why do they feel stuck? That's what I'm confused of. Why would you feel stuck?
We have the emperor. This king of pentacles could have found out why this uh, partner was uh, so inconsistent with them. Alright. They're in this emperor energy. This is like a father figure. Um, this person could be in a relationship. Um, have a whole family. This king of pentacles is stuck. They feel stuck. I guess this person found out why this person was so inconsistent with them. Okay. Now, it could be two guys in masculine energy. It could be a man and a woman. And, you know, both masculine energy. You know, energy is energy. Um, the cards are what the cards are, and this is all masculine energy coming out on the board. So, these, like, dominant characters, okay? And yes, you can be dominant and still feel trapped in your head about shit. Um, with this Eight of Swords cup that this King of Pentacles is going through. Okay. What's going on with this situation with the King of Swords? Okay. We have a High Priestess and Ace of Swords in the reverse. High Priestess in the upright. Put the Ace of Swords in the reverse. This High Priestess is um, giving false readings. They spin the narrative. They could have been telling something to this King of Swords that, you know, um, works in their favor. Alright. Um, but it wasn't divinely guided in. Alright. This was a straight toxic connection. We had the Ace of Cups in the reverse and the Ace of Wands in the upright. That's all it was. No blessings. Somebody was just taking from a cup. It was being dumped out. Just taking, 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 draining it out. Somebody was draining somebody. Maybe someone's in the air, right? Toxic relationship. Yeah, it could have just been about uh, the sex. That's what's going on with this King of Swords energy. That's what's that's what's around this King of Swords energy, okay? Um, this is why they were so inconsistent. And this King of Pentacles that stuck in their head could have found out that now that this King of Swords that was so inconsistent, this King of Swords energy um, is actually a parental figure now. And that's why they're being like inconsistent and cold, it feels like. Emotionless.
not wanting something to be known. Eight of Pentacles. All right. Work. This person could have been acting like that they were working on things with this this energy over here that's stuck in their head. Okay. This person put in work. They were working hard to cover this shit up. They was putting on plenty of work with this individual here. It was something that they were able to get from this King of Pentacles. But it seems like all they wanted was your energy. Time and your energy was um, the value for them. They're being left out in the cold now. They're being left out in the cold because they did this to a star type individual, somebody who actually um, gives not only you know taking care of themselves but they also pour into the things around them the people that are around them the places that they go to okay somebody's being left out in the cold because this is who they did this to they got us they got um They're got, they gotta find a way out of this, but they can't. They gotta find a way out of this, but they can't. Two of Cups in the reverse with the Six of Pentacles on top of this King of Pentacles and the Eight of Swords in the reverse. Like something was like not fair, not equal, unjustified, okay, unjustified partnership. Unbalanced, just keeping you stuck. In the same spot. That's what somebody is seeing. This is why this person is stuck in their head. That's exactly why that person is in the Five of Pentacles in the reverse. Like I said, they did this to a um, an individual that you know feeds into everything around them. You know, this was a toxic, toxic individual, like blood sucker. Um, energy vampire. You have to pay attention to how you feel when you're around people because that'll let you know exactly what's going on in your field. You can be around people that make you happy, giddy, you know, and then everything is all good. Like I said, um, you ever be around people and, you know, all of a sudden, every time I'm with this person, this type of crap happens. Or every time I'm with this person, this type of stuff always happens, you know, and it'll be a good thing. Like, there's no coincidences at all. Everything happens with reason. Everything happens for a reason. There's a reason behind everything that happens in this life. It's for you to learn and grow. 
from everything that you've done, did, or about to do. Situations that you go through is how you come out of them. But we've been programmed to talk about and deal with our problems instead of talking about how we're going to fix them. You know? How can we grow from them? How can we do better from them? So this person is toxic. There's no more cards than that. This is conflict. Alright, the conflict they sent out towards somebody is coming back onto them. Yeah, so this energy, like I said, um, with the double energy, you're listening to man. You're listening to the live. You're taking advice from people who don't always strike out with the best outcomes with their advice, you know? You're dealing with people that, you know, they want you to feel how they feel. This is why they put you in that type of uh, locked up energy. Alright? Because it doesn't matter what you see or what you found out that's going on over here. All that's happening just like in the other reading that I did like I don't know if I want to post it I might I don't know but I mean people are going to you know treat you and do to you what they have been going through so no matter what you see that's going on over here no matter what you are you know thinking like oh yeah okay so somebody lied they did this on purpose you know just to scroll around and everything else and this is why they were in a non consistent energy and then you find out that this person you know is you know the emperor of this whole situation you know now is a parental figure and you know everything else and emotionless and everything they're doing this to that person too they're doing this to that person too. Especially, especially if the person, um, especially if, you know, it's actually the, the two, uh, men that I'm talking about. And, I mean, think about it. You have to be careful because, you know, you see how it's not just one sex it's, 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 it's both of them you know men and women they, they do the same things to each other it's always the blame game somebody did this or somebody did that instead of taking accountability from themselves into what the hell spilled over like seriously um, this is why you know people always get ass hurt and shit but it's just like um, whatever they've done to you they're doing to them and what I was saying is especially if they are you know male counterparts because this whole thing is um, now they're in a position where towards they have to sit here and stick with something that was supposed to be a short time alright and they're not even interested in the opposite sex you know they're interested in the same sex which means this person doesn't have anything that they actually want other than their seed but this person wasn't really ready for that but they're a good figure and that's why they're around but they're trying to keep up the appearance but this could also be because they're trying to hide from their real selves, okay? So this is somebody, like, basically covering up who they are and masking it with a family right here, okay?
but either way, it doesn't matter. Male counterparts, male, female, you know, partnership counterparts and everything. Like, um, whatever and however this situation unfolded, it was supposed to unfold like this. Because this is this person's karma. Okay. It's just you wasn't able to see certain things, okay, about this until you did. It's one of those situations, it wasn't until it was. That's what I'm getting off of this. You could have been wondering why, you know, you had some conflicting energies coming towards you and everything and kind of harshness at first, but that shit backfired. It was because of them. This is stuff that they like started to say. This is stuff they started doing, spreading, getting people all rallied up against you. All for listening to the lived. And the double they listened to was this high priestess that was telling them lies. Alright? In order for them to dump out their cup full of blessings. See, they thought that this person was the one with the blessings. So they use enticement to get to them. Sexual energy, lust, the toxicness of it all that kept them stuck. And now they're, you know, bound into a situation that makes sense. That's why they want you to feel stuck and bound and not able to, you know, um, just be stuck right where you are because it's just like, now they are, you know? Like, literally, they are. They're not mentally stuck there. They know exactly what's going on. But physically, they feel like they're stuck. That's why they want you mentally stuck. They're putting in your head what they're going through physically. That's what it looks like. But yeah, this person is what they were doing all along. And they are upset because they're being left out in the cold. Because now they're realizing what type of person, um, the person that they did this to, the people that they did this to. Okay. So, that is the reading for this morning. And, um, I'll probably upload the other one. I'm not sure. Um, I wasn't trying to make one so long, so, mm, we'll see. So, um, this one I'm about to upload now, and, um, yeah, because the other energy was just, like, that was some, some crazy shit. I'm like, what the fuck? That's why I'm like, I don't know if I'm going to post that. <laughs> um, yeah, but if I do, I do. If I don't, I don't. If it comes back up, then we know what I have to. Um, because some things I just read out, I'm like, what the fuck is going on? Um, and other things, it's just like, okay, you know what? Let me start recording. <laughs> so, yeah. Um, I'll post this up and I will talk to you guys later. So, yeah. Got a day off here. Oh, so I'm just relaxing and chilling. So, yeah. Alright, so, I will talk to you guys later, um, let me finish getting my stuff together so I can run these errands and then get my butt together and then go to the gym later, and like I said, I need a 24 hour gym, so, I don't have to start looking for one because, um, alright, I hope this reading helped out somebody, made something a little bit Clear. If it resonated, it resonated. Give it a like. Um, if it didn't, don't 
don't worry I do readings all the time here and there I give up my messages and um yeah so have a good day and I will talk to you guys later